What is going on guys and welcome back to another NHL expansion franchise mode video. And yeah, today Yeah, we're going to be doing another yeah, we're gonna do another season. So um we're gonna be going over the guys. We have Mitch Marner, Quentin Byfield, and Jake Gensel. And on the second line we have Cole Caulfield, Chandler Stevenson, and Patrick Kane. Johnny Marchessault, so Casey Millsat, and Nikolai Ehlers, Ellie Tolvanen, Johnny Huberto, and Frank Ritano. And guys, yeah, dude, I somehow acquired this guy in free agency last video, as you, yes, as some of you saw. Um, and Quentin Byfield, I got from a trade, which is pretty cool. Cole Caulfield, I also got from a trade. Nikolai Ehlers, I picked up from free agency. And yeah. Oh yeah, Patrick Kane, I also got from a trade. I am going to try and trade this guy. Uh, because, I mean, like, he's losing trade value and he's freaking 35 years old. So, yeah, he's probably going to get out of here. Uh, on defense... You have Travis Sanheim, Brandon Montour, Bet Pesci, Ivan Provorov, Thomas Harley, and Eric Chernak is jumping in the lineup. And in goal, we have our tandem, Jeremy Swayman and Spencer Knight. And then for the scratch players, yeah, you see that's their stack as well. There's an 87 overall, Shane Gossier. Don't know how he's on the scratch roster, but like, can't really do anything about it because I ain't gonna freaking, you know. Yeah. It's like I already put, I already put head coach edit lines on. That's really helpful because I don't have to like stop the sim multiple times and edit the lines. It's freaking annoying. Yeah, whatever, the head coach rules, I guess. Minnesota's jerseys look very good, though. Yeah, so they're just gonna build their home jersey. And yeah, let's go. And we do have a hundred on offense. And 95 in defensive goal tendings. Yeah, this season is probably going to be our season. Like, holy crap, our team is stacked. And, of course, the controller does that. Whatever. It does that all the time. Here we go. Yeah, I don't know how Jake Gensel moved up to a 92 overall. That's actually really insane. Montour, Caulfield. Oh! Okay. Yeah, I didn't think that was going in. Wow. Oh. Oh. Patrick Kane, let's go! There's a the heartbreaker. Too bad we have to trade him, because well, it was going to go down very badly. Hopefully he doesn't go up. I like the risks. Oh, crap. We'll set. Oh, let's go, dude. We're absolutely dominating. For Casey Middlestat, the first goal of his season. Now, I say again. Oh. What a goal. Wow. 
Wow. Good. And Boldy with the goal. Bro, I came to defend for my life. Oh, Byfield! There we go. Oh my gosh. I failed. There we go, dude. Okay. I was going to tangle, but I guess that failed. I tried to pull insane moves, but that wouldn't work. There's much more. Oh. You can end anyways. Chop it to the end. First win of the season. Happening to be the first game of the season. There it is. First round for 2028 and see if that works. Yeah, that does. So now we have Devontae's. That's a pretty good trade there. Patrick Kane and Adam Lilquist. There you go. So Patrick Kane is now back in Detroit. And now we have Lucas Raymond. That's really good. Okay, there we go. So Matt Boldy is on this team now. So we got rid of the guys we wanted to get rid of. So now we're going to be simulating to the trade deadline. Okay, so I decided to skip the trade deadline since our team is doing really good right now. But yeah, we're just gonna go into big trades that happened. Um, John Tavares got traded to the Buffalo Sabres. Uh, yeah, that's, okay, yeah, I, I guess that's it. So now we're just simming to the end of the season. Oh, Taylor Rat, Yo. Taylor Radish. I mean, yeah, I guess. <laughs> Not really going to turn into anything, though. Yeah, never mind. The Tropics literally just missed a playoffs. So, um... Yeah. This division is stacked anyway. Like, ain't no way we can make the playoffs anyways, dude. Because... Oh my gosh, this division. Dude, there's no single team in this division that has more losses than wins. This is absolutely crazy. The Atlantic division is very deadly, dude. Um, so, in the entire league, let's see where we are at. So, yeah, the Rangers. Yeah, the Rangers are first in the entire league. Along with Boston, and it's domination from the freaking Atlantic Division. Okay, yeah, Miami is twelfth in the entire league, and they missed the playoffs. They, bro. Oh yeah, there's also a team that's not in the entire league and missed the playoffs somehow. Yeah, but that's insane, dude. Like, this is the most stacked division ever. Like, holy. Rick, man. There's no way we could even win that. But anyways, Jake Gensel is going to be leading the entire team in points with 86. And Cole Caulfield coming in second with 85. And the rest did not really perform that good. Not even Mitch Marner even showed up. I don't even know where the heck he was on the stats. Yeah, I have no idea where he is, bro. <laughs> Dude. That's okay. No, wait, 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 see, that's okay. No, that is not okay, dude. What the heck? Yeah, you know what? If he's just gonna perform like that, I might just trade this guy away. Oh, actually... Oh, hold up. He had, he only played 22 games. Oh, you know what happened? He probably got injured. 
he probably got injured for a long time. Yeah, that might be why. But like 13 points in 22 games is not that good. And dude, the injuries really just took took us away. Yeah, that that's the weirdest season ever, actually. Uh, let's just look at the entire league. See here. Okay. So yeah, it's gonna be Connor McDavid leading the entire league. He's literally ninety eight overall. Braden Point coming second, and Joel Pavelski is on here at forty years old. And we also have Steven Stamkos and Tyler Toffoli. I don't know why. Oh, crap. Yeah, I actually regret trading this guy. He just turned to a 90 overall. Uh, there's David Pasternak, Paul Connors, Matthews. Uh, 11 goals. Yeah, that's Pasta. And Suzuki is in five. Uh, oh. Okay. Oh, jeez. I'm so glad I didn't claim it in waivers. Jeez. Didn't know Nate Danielson was playing. Wow. So, now for the defenseman, Kale McCarr, because he's that guy. And then let's see, goaltenders. It's gonna be Igor Shosturkin. And yeah. Okay, where did Florida go? We go. Where's Jeremy Swayman? Yeah, we're not gonna see Jeremy Swayman. Though this guy has the best mustache in the league. Like I know there's Philip Forsberg, but like I just think this guy has the best mustache in this league. Yeah, that season was freaking weird. Like, and the Tropics were 12th and missed the playoffs. But we're just going to simulate the entire playoffs, get right to the draft. Actually, we don't even have interest for the draft. I'm just going to. So, in the playoffs, Tampa Bay is going to be hoisting the Stanley Cup against the Nashville Predators. Uh, I don't know how Nashville even got there. <laughs> but yeah, Tampa Bay is going. To win it, even without Eric Chernak, that's kind of surprising. But yeah, that season was weird, though. Like, jeez, man. And the awards are open, so let's see. So yeah, those are the team awards, individual awards. Yeah, Joe Pavelski, absolutely insane, though. Yeah, Steven Stamkos is going to get the Conn's knife. Um, yeah, Ilya Sorokin with the Vezina. It looks like we're not going to see any uh, Miami player. Alrighty. We're going to be simulating the offseason. Alright, retired players. Nichols Backstrom is retiring. That guy had a good career. There's Corey Perry, Zach Parisi, Voracek, Sam Gagner. Hmm. There's a Bilgoski, Cogliano. There's also Ryan Reeves. I know him. Yeah, and for the goaltenders, Alex Stalock. Okay, yeah, I actually watched him before. Yeah, the goaltenders, oh yeah, we're, okay, dude, we have to offer Spencer Knight a contract. So we're gonna, oh, whoops. So we're gonna lock this guy down long term. We're not, I'm not gonna look for six million. We're going for a long term contract. Let's do 10 mil. And we're just gonna let Lucas Dostal walk, cause like he doesn't really deserve to be on an AHL team. So yeah. 
That's it for the resign phase. There's literally no one. So Spencer Knight's going to renew his contract. So. Oh my goodness. Okay. Artemi Panarin, yeah. No freaking words, man. Welcome to the Miami Tropics. Even though you're probably not going to be here for a while. Because you're like 33 years old. But hey, a 96 overall, I'll freaking take it. There you go, 16.7 million for, for the next four years. You're coming to the Miami. Let's go. Rasmus Anderson, he's an 88 overall. Yeah, dude, we're getting a lot of good players in this free agency, especially our Tendi Panarin. Huge, huge, huge. But Patrick Lyon, A. Here you go. And there's also Mason Marchment. An 87 overall. There you go, 9.5 mil. And let's see. Oh, Simon Nemich is on here. That guy's an RFA, yeah. I don't really do RFAs, but like. I'll try offering this guy, hopefully. Over 5.1 million for four years. Yeah, no, I don't have the over draft picks. So. Yeah, Matthew Joseph, let's offer this guy. He's coming back to Miami. Probably gonna trade him, but eh. He's pretty good. I'm getting Malkin on there, but that guy freaking stopped growing. Uh Alright, goaltenders. Oh okay. Thatcher Demko. Yeah, we're going all in this season. Let's go, dude. Hopefully we get all these players. There we go. Fourteen point five million for the next seven years. Yeah. So now we're gonna be simulating to next season. Let's hope that our Timmy Panarin has signed the contract. Okay, Rasmus Anderson's coming. Patrick Lyonne is coming. Mason Marchment. And okay, yeah, Artemi Panarin is coming here. Matthew Joseph and Thatcher Demko. Let's go. That is some awesome free agency. Awesome here. Alrighty, so captains here. We're gonna take away Cold Caulfield's A, and we're gonna give it to Artemi Panarin. Because, yeah, this guy is, yeah, this guy deserves it the most. So, yeah, Mitch Marner, bro, like, this guy put up, wait, how many points again? I have no freaking idea, whatever. Yes, yeah, so the Spencer Knight and Thatcher Demko, yeah, we're going to be trading some guys here. Alrighty. So... We're gonna make some trades. You don't belong in the AHL, you belong in the NHL, so get the heck out of here. Okay, I might seem crazy about this, but like, our, our Timmy Panarin could be traded to the Colorado Avalanche for someone. Um, Nathan McKinnon? That might actually be the guy we try to get. Yeah. Or send me Panarin for Nathan McKinnon. Dude, like, we're pretty close in this deal. If we add... Maybe a third round... Maybe a third rounder. If that's not gonna go, then we'll probably do two third rounders. Because, dude... This would be very good. Okay, so they're not gonna do that. Let's add a second rounder, then. Our semi-pernair and two-thirds of the second for Nathan McKinnon. 
That's not gonna work. So add another third. There we go. The Miami Tropics now have Nathan McKinnon. Dude, this team's gonna be a powerhouse, man. Holy crap. Alrighty, there are the lines for year three. So we're just gonna go over the lines and then we're gonna end this video off. So Nathan McKinnon at 97 overall, then Jake Gensel and Mitch Marner. Absolutely awesome. And we have Cole Caulfield, Patrick Liney, Matt Boldy. And the third line, Mason Marchman, Clinton Byfield, who just went up to an 88 overall. That's pretty good. And Lucas Raymond. And on the fourth line, Matthew Joseph, Casey Middlestat, and Dylan Gunther. Fantastic. On defense, we have Devontae and Rasmus Anderson. Brandon Montour, overall, Harley and Pesci. So yeah, our defense got way better. So now looking at the goaltenders. Thatcher Demko is our new guy. He's Spencer Knight. Very phenomenal there. And yeah, the scratch players just proved how stacked this team is. Probably gonna trade Ellie Tolvin in. But yeah, that's it for this video. And okay, hold on. One second. Nathan McKinnon is not wearing the right number. Um Okay, where's Captain New Jersey? There it is. Nathan McKinnon is wearing a very wrong number. He should not be wearing number 31. And Cole Caulfield should not be an A. Giving him the A. And... Yeah. Yeah. Nathan McKinnon, there you go. We now have number 29. And let's see who else needs a change here. Um, Patrick Lane. Uh, let's see, Cole Caulfield. Uh, yeah, Cole Caulfield deserves number 22. Do it. And, yeah, I think that's it. Uh, the little Devontes. I don't know if he wears number seven, but I'll just ignore that. So, yeah, we're going to be ending this video here. So, so, I hope you guys have enjoyed this next episode. We will be simulating this season. So, yeah, if you enjoyed, please leave a like and hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys later.